so today we're gonna be learning how to make a chaplet which looks like this <laughs> all right guys so in your bag you should have a long piece of twine and a short piece we're gonna be starting with the longer piece that has the loop already attached to it all right so first you're gonna take the loop end of the chaplet and you're gonna go down a little bit and start wrapping it around three times and then you're gonna pull the back string the very back one through the other ones. Repeat that knot nine times, so you have a total of 10. So next we're gonna leave a little bit of space and make the Our Father bead. To do that, you just do four loops instead of three. So next we're gonna leave a little bit of room and make the cross. Do the cross, do three Hail Marys in a row, and make sure they're close enough together that they can form the beginning of the cross. This is what your cross should start to look like once you get to that point. So next, you want to take your shorter piece of string, and all you want to do is wrap it together like this to make a little loop right there so that you can connect it to the cross, which we're going to show you how to do. So next, you're going to take that loop that you had, and tie it with the three Hail Mary loops. So you want to put it right below the first one so you have two on the bottom and one on the top. Pull to tighten. Next you're going to take the little string that you attach to the cross and on each side you're going to make a Hail Mary bead and then pull it together to make the cross. This is what it should look like once you have both sides done. Once you get to this point right here, bring it back to your small group so we can help you finish it. And then this is what it's going to look like afterwards. You can wear it as a bracelet or have it on your keychain or whatever.